What's going on, Pokemon Master? Pony Trace here. We're back today with the Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire Live Wi Fi battle today up against Blue, aka Hokist91. I think that's how you say it. Really hope I said it right. But yes, uh, his Twitter link will be down in the description below. And remember, if you want a chance to battle, like, go ahead and follow me on Twitter because I do ask for battles on there uh, quite often, actually. So we're using the same team for the past three battles. Uh, just because I didn't have enough time to build a team and some things came up, so we have to do this battle quick. So we are using, we are rocking out with, actually, we're not using, we're rocking out with the Victini, Mega Lake, Thunderous, the Raptor, Verizion, and Sylveon. A very, very good team. Uh, right now, what I want you to do in the comment section below, comment who you think is going to be the MVP, the most valuable Pokemon on our team today. Um, I think the MVP is probably going to be Mega Glade, just because Mega Glade is just amazing. Mega Glade is so good. Now let's start this battle. Let's waste no time out all because wasting time is not fun we do not like to waste time around these parts so blue is rocking out with the charizard gengar raikou thunderous t a kirin black and a dragonite so all right took a picture two dragon types two electric types and that is him. he might even have three electric or three dragon types if that's a charizard x which is going to be dangerous and just looking at his team that is a hugely offensive team um he has two Pokemon weak to the Hidden Power Ice. I think probably Staraptor is going to be our best bet in this battle with the Choice Scarf Bravery. That is just going to be amazing. We're going to need to probably keep Rizion Sash in case that Kieran Black wants to be annoying. But we have Hyper Voice for him. I think we can probably just lead off with uh, lead off with Bond and just be pretty safe, honestly. So what I think we're going to do. Or Victine is a pretty safe lead too, but I don't really like to do that. So we're going to lead off with Sylveon. Lead off with Sylveon just because Sylveon is really good. Really, really, really good. And uh, it hits basically every single Pokemon on his team with either Psy Shock or Hyper Voice. Or Shadow Ball, actually. We don't even need to Psy Shock. We can just Shadow Ball that that uh, get that Gengar. Right in the face! Right in the face because we don't, we don't care. Right in the face. So here's Sylveon. And he leads off with Fulgurus, which is the Thunderous. Okay. Thunderous. Okay, we're going to Hyper Voice. Uh, or we can Psy Shock. I actually really want to Psy Shock over Hyper Voicing. Just because uh, this thing is more specially defensive than defensive. He's probably going to Volt Switch though. He might Flash Cannon. I, I don't know. I have no idea. I also kind of want to predict the Gengar. So, yeah, that's kind of why. Yeah, we're going to Psy Shock. We might as well. Psy Shock should be able to take him out of the way. He's going to Thunder. He lands the Thunder. Hello, how do you land the Thunder? Eat it up, Sylveon. Eat it up. He gets the Paralyze. He lands it, and he gets the Paralyze. Of course. Just my luck. Just my luck right there. Here's the Psy Shock. Doesn't even take... I'm so disappointed right now. I am so disappointed right now. Now he's going to U-turn. Oh, fun times. Fun times. And that's going to do pitiful damage. I, I didn't even know Thunderous got U-turn. I did not know that. Okay, that's actually really good information. Got to keep that in mind now. I might even give my Thunderous U-turn. I don't know. I really didn't know Thunderous learned that. He's going to go out to Dragonite. We're going to get a Psy Shock off, and this should do a decent chunk. He does have his multi-scale, though, but Dragonite's not known for being too bulky. So, yeah, it did a lot, and that was multi-scale damage. So, we're just going to stay in here in Psy Shock again. He couldn't just try Dragon Dancing and hope that I get paralyzed or something. He's going to Ice Beam. Specially Offensive Dragonite. Okay, that is actually pretty interesting. And he's Life Orb. Okay, maybe he's not even... Okay, Paralyzed. Fun! Fun! That is amazing. We're gonna Psy Shock again. The Hacks is just... The Hacks is great today. The Hacks is great. Now he's going to Dragon Rush, but it does not affect us. Here's a Psy Shock. And that is gonna take out this Dragonite. Down goes the Dragonite. We got Crit. Crit did not matter. I mean, judging by how much damage that Psy Shock did, didn't matter. And I like that. I liked it a lot because it did not matter. I don't know why he Dragon Rush, though. That's actually pretty odd. That's pretty odd. Usually, if he's special offensive, you'd probably see Dragon Pulse uh, or Dragon Claw or even Outrage. I have no idea. I don't know why he went for that. Okay, I'm kind of just sacking off this Sylveon now because we don't really need it. We're going to stay in here and Psyshock this Raikou right in the face. He's going to crunch. A physical Raikou. I am so, I am so surprised. We can actually eat that. Yeah, we eat that up. Delicious. I'm surprised. Oh, we get paralyzed. Oh, okay. All right, we're going to Psyshock again. Sylveon. Get your head in the game, Sylveon. He's going to crunch you in. Get your head in the game, Sylveon. Sylveon, please. Get your head in the game. Get your head in the game, Sylveon. Yes, Sylveon. Yes, yes. There's a side shock. Take out this Raikou. Take him out. 
Oh, just kidding. He ate that up. Okay, we're going to side shock again. How was Raikou so fat? How is he so fat? We can eat this up. We can eat this up. Eat it up. Eat it up. We live with one. Yes, Sylveon. Yes. I don't know why he. I don't know why he doesn't have a specially offensive Raikou. Especially offensive. I had so much spit in my mouth. That was disgusting. Oh, that was nasty. That was disgusting. Okay. <laughs> well, Sylveon just took out two Pokemon. Just I didn't even have to hyper voice, and I took out. I didn't even switch. Didn't even. I don't know. I like that a lot. We live on one HP though, and that's kind of lucky. He's gonna go out to his Gengar. We're gonna stay in here in Psy Shock. No reason not to. We're at one HP and we're paralyzed. He's gonna pull a physical Gengar. I actually really like these sets a lot. I like these sets a lot. These sets are actually really good. They're not too viable, but they're really fun. They're really fun. I cannot believe physical Gengar. Wait, was this Gengar shiny? Shiny Gengar looks the exact same. Okay. Um, I think we can just go out to Staraptor right now and get a kill, but I don't really want to do that. I want to go out into Thunderous T, but, 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 he has, he has the stuff, so we can't really do that. We're just going to go out into, no we're not, what can I go out into? We can go out to Victini, I guess. We're going to go out into Victini just because I don't know what else to go out into, really. I have no idea what else to go out into, and we're just going to V-Create. Or Fusion Bolt. No, we're going to V-Create. Why would we Fusion? We're going to V-Create. He stays in with the Gengar. Here's the V-Create. This is going to take him out unless he's Sash, which he most likely is. Is this a Sash Gengar? It's not a Sash Gengar. Okay. Our speed's going to drop. Our defense is going to drop. Our special defense is even going to drop. But that is fine. He knows that we're Scarf now, though, because his Gengar just got outsped. So he knows that we're Scarf, but that's fine by me. He's going to go into Mr. Freeze, the Curum. Um, we didn't get our attack lowered. We did get our speed lowered, but we're Scarf. So I think we might be able to have speed. I don't know. I'm going to stay in here because I don't want it to set up a free substitute if that's the kind of set he is. I don't want him to get up a sub for free. And we do outspeed, so this V-Crate is actually going to take him out, is it? He's Dragon type, so it's neutral, right? Maybe it's still super effective. Oh, we got a crit! Yes, Victini! Yes, Victini! Victini is so good. That's a huge throw out of the way. Yes, Victini and Sylveon are just so good. Yes, Victini and Sylveon. Both my defenses are at minus two, though, so that's not really too much fun. Gonna go out to his Charizard now. Okay, we're swapping. We are swapping. We are swapping. We're gonna swap out into Thunderous T. Yeah, we're gonna swap out into, th into Thunderous T because I have, I have no idea. I have no idea what this thing wants to do. That is why. He's a Charizard X. Okay, this might be bad. This might, what are you going for? Don't Dragon Dance. Do not Dragon Dance. I know you do not want to Dragon Dance. Don't do it. Don't do it. Earthquake. All right, perfect. Per I didn't even predict that, but perfect. Perfect, perfect. We're going to hit him Power Ice just, can, just in case. I didn't even know what I just said. Just in case you saw the Thunderous T, which it looks like he's doing. He goes out to Fulgurus, which is, is his Thunderous T. Okay, well, this Thunderous T is going to go down. Go down to the ground. Super effective. Yup, down goes the Thunderous T. That's actually... Wow, this is a quick... I liked this battle a lot. That was a nice and quick battle. A nice and quick battle. What does he have left? He has Raikou and Charizard, I think. That's what I'm pretty sure is left. But I'm not 100% sure. But I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. We're going to swap out into Victini. Victini is kind of just Death Water right now. Kind of just Death Water for us. Because we don't need it too much. Really, um... I don't know what we can do to a Charizard X. What is he going to do? He's gonna flare blitz. We should eat that up. Eat it up, Victini. Eat it up, Victini. Victini, eat it up. Eat it up. Eat it up. Oh, that didn't even do half. I will take it. And he takes recoil damage. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Now we can U turn, brick break, or fusion bolt. Um, we're gonna brick break just because I don't want to like, get my uh, I don't want to get our defenses dropped or lowered, whatever, or speed lowered. So that's the safer play. He's gonna earthquake. That should be able to take us out. Super effective. Uh, it's a Charizard X. Yup does take us out i don't know what i like better shiny charizard x or regular charizard x i still i don't know yet i have no idea they both look really good but we have a safe switch into star raptor now we can just double edge everything on the field and it's gonna be gone it's gonna be gone it's gonna be gone not done it's gonna be gone here's the double edge double edge flying in like a star raptor star raptor is so good there's the double edge down goes charizard i really want to build a bulky charizard x so bad but i just don't have enough time Oh, I need to make time. And actually, his Raikou went down. Okay. 
All right, well, that's the end of the battle. Thank you for watching. The MVP was definitely Sylveon. So if you voted for Sylveon to be the MVP, you just won yourself seven quarters. Seven quarters, that is insane. That is insane. Seven quarters, you can do so much with that. Now, remember, if you enjoyed, please leave a like rating down below. It helps out so much, and it puts a smile on my face, even though that sounds really, really corny, <laughs> but it does. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe so you never miss a video. That is it. Have a nice shit.